Mike, a good three shooting team hurt you guys on the perimeter. What's the fix to the perimeter defense? Uh, we just got to do a better job of, uh, you know, closing out. I think that we've done a better job of being in help positions in the paint, uh, especially on guards trying to get to the rim. But we have to do the multiple efforts. We have to be able to help in on drives and uh, be able to get out when they swing it to the, to the corners and uh, to the three-point shooters. What's the biggest thing you see that, that you guys can take care of before tomorrow? Uh, really, it's, it's, you know, I thought we played a pretty, pretty decent game, but uh, a lot of it's defensively. I think if we can you know, sure up with a couple things defensively, whether it's um, sharing up rotations and communicating a little bit better, I think uh, we'll have a better chance of winning. Tomorrow you guys have Miami, you know, no rest for the weary. What do they do that's so dangerous? Well, you know, D-Wade's playing at a high level. Chris Bosh obviously is playing at a high level. Uh, they, they they play well together. They, that's a team that's, that's been going to the promised land. They've won big games, won championships, and, uh, you know, they know how to win. So, you know, we got to be ready to go. But he was banged up out there, he had a little ice, is there any concern moving forward? Or no, I don't think so. I think it was, uh, you know, I just want to get it checked out right then, and, uh, you know, I feel good. How frustrating is it Vince hits those two big threes and, and you guys go to overtime and you just drained out? Uh, it's frustrating, you know. We played hard, they played hard. Vince made some great plays down the stretch. Uh, we had our chances to win, and that's all you can ask for. We just have to execute and be able to make those plays, uh, the winning plays, in order to win the game. You have Tony back in time to, to get on James Harden. What does he do that, that adds to your team so much? And Tony brings a different dynamic. You know, defensively, he's our he's our leader. He's the guy that, that does all the dirty work. He he's up and down the court. Uh, you know, he's he's cheering us on. He's our, he's our biggest fan. So I mean, he's the guy that really gets our team going, um, and he just adds that dynamic to it. Anything else?